which was your first approach to the to the musing and composing? So when did, did everything started? I wrote my first song when um, I uh, I got into trouble at school for, for smoking cigarettes, and um, and I was sent home to my to my uh, parents. My, my parents were very disappointed in me. Um, and I think I, I was very frustrated because I, I, I don't like letting people down and I don't like disappointing people. Um, so I, I took my guitar and I went into my room and about 20 minutes later I'd written like a, a song and it sort of, it just hit me across the face with like a, a baseball bat. It felt like, like it had gone like really very quickly and it felt good, it, it felt sort of relieving. And what about musically? So, which was the record that changed your life? Um, if there is one or more, hmm. I think uh, probably Jimi Hendrix. How you experienced changed my life. And what do you think about? You are very young, so what do you think about the modern music or, or music of te these ten years? Respect, um, of course, in the 70s we have such a great band in the 80s and the 90s, but nowadays? Nowadays I think there's, there's some really good ba new bands and new artists. Um, us, like Robin, I think, I think she's, she's, she's my favorite pop act. Um, and, there's, uh, and there's Plan B, who's sort of pop, but he's, he's taken you know, stuff from, from the Motown era but made it sort of more cinematic and he's sort of got more of a, a vision on music rather than, rather than just sort of pop, I guess. So it's very hard to classify music, so which is the genre that gives you the most um, when you listen? I think cla I listen to a lot of classical music. Um, I think particularly like uh, I get very distracted by, by lyrics. So if I'm listening to music and I can hear sort of lyrics or um, then I, I immediately switch off of what I've been doing before and then start listening to it. Whereas classical music is sort of, you can sort of have a conversation while listening to it or you can just think to yourself. Um, I listen to a lot of uh, Arvo Part, who's one of my favourite composers, and uh, Beethoven. So yesterday you played uh, in Milano. So with, what do you think about Italian people? Um, I love it here. I think it, it was the first first gig we did in, in Italy, and it was a showcase. And usually showcases are, are quite dull. There's there's not really much of an, an atmosphere. But I sort of. I felt sort of excited and I could feel a, a lot of uh, a lot of energy, even though it was a small room. I think that's probably why. Um, but uh, I really I enjoyed myself. A lot. So if I was there, so if that was a showcase, what we have to expect from a gig from you? Um, same sort of thing, I guess, just with no cameras, just like right up in there. Um, but uh, a lot more energy. I think I was a bit sleepy yesterday. But um, yeah, I'm always coming and playing some gigs in this